So I am attempting the 10,000 calorie challenge again and I've learned from my mistakes last time so let's go and get it and this time I'm gonna do it. So I am still suffering with some blood but I'll show you my starting off physique anyway. So I've already learned from last time, it's currently 9.40 and I'm starting to eat now and it's not a massive bulky meal like last time and I'm not starting the midday so I'm already better. So I've got these caramel crispies from Tesco's. Already, I feel 10 times better than I did last time, so that's probably that's nearly a thousand calories there. I think I'm gonna scan into my fitness pal, which I'll be using today, and I don't feel full or anything, I feel absolutely fine. I'm gonna get a few minutes just to settle in my tummy. So, I've got this huge bag of mixed nuts and raisins, it says per 100 grams, 541 calories. There's 500 grams in here, so that's over 2,000 calories in this bag. So, I'm just gonna So the only problem with these nuts is I, they're just really painful for the jaw. Like you spend so much time heavily chewing, my jaw is killing. Like I'm not even full. I definitely could eat something else. So I've got some dairy milk, chocolate caramel. This is super easy to eat. I know it's got a fair bit of calories in, so I'm just gonna try and finish this bar right now. Time to get changed, take Alfie out, burn some calories and try and get a little bit more hungry. Let's go. So we're gonna put in two Chicago Town pizzas for my lunch. Let's have a look. Looking beautiful. Now let's whack them in the oven. So the Chicago Town pizzas are now in the oven. So while that's cooking, it's gonna take about 20 minutes. I'm gonna just nibble on a few sweets and just try and tick over the calorie clock. Let's get into some... Fizzy fish. Is it fizzy fish? Yes, fizzy fish. <laughs> I'm so sure that's a weird, it is a weird name. I don't know who chose this, strange name. But anyways, let's get into some of these. Actually, it's not a lot. I'm hoping it's just going to keep things ticking over. So I'm actually feeling, I don't want to say it yet, but optimistic. So before I eat the pizza, time to get changed back into my pajamas, something loose on my tummy, and let's get into eating. So I might have slightly overcooked cheese pizza, but we move. Now let's tuck in. So I put on the fork, just one bite. I'm so full right now, and now I'm struggling a little. I am full, but I'm hoping if I just give it an hour, we'll just go away. So here's to the last bite, Will. I'm so sore now and I'm feeling a little bit sick. This is the first time in this challenge where I think like, oh, not a good time. Like, so I'm hoping I can push through it and give it myself a little bit of time. So 
as you just saw, I've got some fish food, Ben and Jerry's, and some M&M's. Time to try and devour this, and I'm hoping it gives me a lot of calories. We'll see. So a little bite on camera for you. Oh, I'm just smacking my mess, to be honest. So I'm really struggling now. I've had a fair few spoonfuls, but I've got more to eat than I've eaten. Oh, it's getting tough, like, it's getting so, so tough. So this is how much I've got left. I can't even put this in my face right now. I'm gonna put it in the fridge so it can like, go super runny and then I'm going to eat the chocolatey bits out and then hopefully just drink the rest Ooh. so I came up with an idea and I've put it into my fitness power when it comes out at 2800 calories and it isn't actually going to be that much volume of food I don't think so hopefully this might be able to salvage it somewhat so <laughs> I've got the biggest chunk of butter like I don't think it's healthy for anyone to eat this much butter but we're going to Let's whack this in the pan. So that butter's gonna start melting, and then, there with, I am going to add in 10 large eggs, and then this pack of bacon, which is smaller than I thought it was gonna be, but we're here now. So this, 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 and then a full pack of cheese. I'm going to die after this, but it's 2,800 calories, is what we need, let's go. Firstly, please, just look how much butter there is in this frying pan, I think I'm gonna have a heart attack. That looks dreadful. And then look how many eggs there are, I'm actually gonna die. I'm gonna be dead. Now let's whack it in the soup of butter and let's see how this works. All I wanna say is look at this. If I don't make the 10,000 calories, no one can say I didn't try my very best because please look at the the big and it's sitting like an ocean of butter. If that is an effort, I do not know what is. So if you can't hear me properly, I do apologise, but I'm having to put the fan on because it's getting super smoky in here because of the whole bacon and butter fiasco. I've just grated the full block of cheese. Please just see how much cheese is in here. Oh my god. She feels like the weight of like, I don't know what. Too heavy to have that much cheese anyway, so I'm gonna add the eggs in now because it's starting to cook. It does smell nice if I was actually hungry and I didn't see the sea of butter, but we'll see. Let's go. Okay, that looked, <laughs> that looked terrible. I didn't, I, I didn't, mm, I don't know what I was expecting. It isn't a pool of butter, but I was anticipating looking better than that. I will, yeah. Yeah, I will admit I thought it was gonna look better than that. I don't know if you can see that, but the egg is actually sitting under the butter. Why? Why, why is it doing that? Yum. So I stirred it to try and get all the cheese and everything in there. <laughs> this mess. This is not what I envisioned at all. 
Anyone for a boiling pile of sick? Mm, yummy! It just won't. It just won't cook properly, and the bottle won't evaporate. And it's just a big, a super big mess. And I was really hoping this was going to bring you close to me, gallery. My calorie goal. I don't know how I'm gonna eat this, I don't know how I'm gonna cook it. That is so much scrambled egg. I honestly thought in my head, I don't know, I, I don't know what I was thinking. I thought 10 eggs, how much can that be? Surely that won't be very much. An egg is only this big. So much egg? That's so much food? I'm gonna die eating this and then when I have, I don't even know how many calories I'm gonna be on. Try something sweet to see if that can help. So I feel so sick now, but I'm just gonna absolutely go for it. I don't want to fail for a second time, so I'm gonna force this down my neck now. I'm really trying to wrap this down my neck, but I just feel so so poo like. Ugh. I'm so annoyed because I feel like it doesn't feel like it's going to happen but I just want it to happen so badly. So I've been going from the scrambled egg to the ice cream. So now I'm going to go back to the scrambled egg again, try and get that finished. And I'm gutted because if I had this and finished off the few nuts that I had left because I've been chopping on nuts as well I've only literally got about a quarter of a bag of that nuts left if I had this, that and a tiny little bit of ice cream left then I'm pretty much in there but I just can't get it down my neck this time I was definitely, definitely closer but I just don't think I have the capacity to eat 10,000 calories, I just don't think I do. I don't, I don't think I'll be trying this again because I, I just, I can't seem to get there. So that is the end of the video. I did really try my best to try and get 10,000 calories. I was close this time, but still didn't manage to do it. I was so good because at the beginning I felt so confident as you saw. I really genuinely thought I was going to do it this time. Oh, I'm so annoyed that I didn't manage to. But anyways, I hope you found this entertaining. If you did, please hit like and subscribe. It means so much to me. And I'll put my, my body through absolute torture for that life. And if you guys want to see me do it for third time lucky, I will, but only if enough people see it over and over again. Do it, do it, do it, do it, do it. Because it was a lot of pain. And like, if you're not that bothered about seeing me actually completely, then I won't do it again. Um, I know in a few previous videos, um, people said about, oh, I tried peanut butter and stuff like that, but I had tried peanut butter pr prior to this to see if I liked it, and I, I don't like the taste, so I wouldn't be able to eat it, because so that, that would be an easy way of doing it. I could have microwaved it, it melted it, and just rammed that in my neck, but I just didn't like it. I don't like Nutella or anything like that. I'm quite a fussy eater, which makes this even more difficult than it already is. But anyways, I'm rambling now, so I'll stop that. And thank you for watching the video. Take care, stay safe, and I'll see you in the next one.